Day two of the CWO Global Pro League is in the books, and the red group is finally starting to take shape. Our first match of the day was Splice going up against Mindfreak, and Splice continued to remain supreme. They have been undefeated in respawn game modes, but for Mindfreak, they continue to play teams tough. They steal the SD, where they've actually been undefeated, but the respawn juggernauts and Splice prove too tough and take the series 3 to 1. Our second match should be Envious and Cloud9. Cloud9's woes continue. A very close map one in which Cloud9 had the advantage throughout most of the game ends with a come from behind victory for Team Envious. They steal game one, and they also managed to steal game two in around 11. But for map three, Cloud9 was on full tilt, and Envy pounded them in the uplink, beating them 24 to two, and burying Cloud9. Cloud9 would play back-to-back -back matches. Next up, it was Splice and it didn't get any better from there. Splice continued their dominance in respawn, also taking out Cloud9 in the game two search and destroy. It was another 3-0 for Splice, another 0-3 result for Cloud9, and Cloud9 now sits at 0-12 in total map counts after two days of competition. In the final match of the day, Envious took on Mind Freak. This is a rematch from day one. Mind Freak played them tough in both hard points on day one. Could they rebound in day two? There were back and forth battles. This time, Mind Freak able to take the uplink, but the result would be the same. This victory keeps Envious in striking distance of the top spot here for the red group. For Mind Freak, they continue to play strong, but will it be enough to secure the third position in day three? The key takeaway for Mind Freak is their ability to keep playing teams tough, but they haven't been able to get the key match victories. They do get one map of Envious, and they look poised to take the third position in this group. That is it for day two. Stay tuned for the final day of the red group. We'll see who will come out on top for their chance to play in the $500,000 stage one final.